My name is Stephen Godkin. I teach physics at Communications High School. I wound up teaching physics because I tutored through college and even a little bit after college. And the job that I got immediately after college, I really hated. Since I still had the part-time tutoring job that I was doing, and my wife said, at least that's not so stressful for you. Why don't you try teaching? And I was like, nah. And she didn't even ask. She just sent my resume to a school. And they called me up and said, we'd like to talk to you about teaching mathematics. And I, I said, OK. I hung up the phone. I, I had a conversation with my wife. She said, trust me, I think you're going to be happier doing that. And I, I interviewed for the job, and I got it. I do like Communications High School a lot. The students make it a lot of fun here. I, I, don't, I come to work, and other than grading the papers, teaching the class is a piece of cake. I like that sometimes students have a perspective or a way of looking at a problem that's new to me, and then I learn something new, like, wow, I like doing it that way. That's better than my way. But my point is, if someone asks you, did it accelerate, you would say yes. yes. Okay. I know the magnetism curriculum here at Communications really well, and that part doesn't challenge me so much. I know how deep it goes and how challenging it gets, so whenever I read something to further my knowledge of magnetism, it's difficult. Like, I know exactly what the students feel like every time I revisit magnetism on a little bit of a higher level than high school level, and you see just how, how insane that particular subject matter can be. So I, that's the part that I like when it gets challenging. I say to my past self, truthfully, this is a shame. This is kind of sad, but I'm going to give you the answer. If I could talk to my past self, I, I'd say that teaching is a lot of fun. But it's going to have its own challenges besides being fun in the classroom. Maybe think about a fallback of, of something else that you can do to make a living too, just in case the hard times get a little bit too hard. Yeah. I wish I had a funny story, but the funny ones? You can't. <laughs> I'm not putting those on film. <laughs> Signing off for the Inkblot, this is Bridget Garrett.